Hey, yeah, basically what this would mean that if passed, all the students here at Central High would have to pass an additional test in order to get that cap and gown. One test could stand between a student and a diploma. I'm pushing for a test that students should pass to graduate, which we had when I was superintendent. Calling it one of his priorities, the new state superintendent, Tom Horn, pushing the idea of requiring high school students to pass an additional test in order to graduate. He feels this will add more value to the high school diploma. Employers know the diploma means something, and we don't graduate any more literate students. Horn says this test was originally in place in the 2000s, but was taken away. It was a great motivation for students to study. Those who are against this proposal feel that one test shouldn't determine whether a student is ready for the real world and only adds to the number of tests they already have to take. We have end of quarter tests, end of chapter tests. Um, we have the AIMS test or the AZ Merit that it's called now test. We have a test that students have to take to show their civic knowledge that has to take for graduation. Marisol Garcia, the president of the Education Association, is against the idea of this pass a test to graduate proposal. She says education has changed over the years and high school students can now take a wide variety of classes, and more goes into determining if a student is ready for the world than a single standardized test. Uh, a test is not gonna measure whether or not a student is prepared for jobs outside of high school or going to a trade school or going to community college. They need to be able to prove that they have an understanding or depth of knowledge of a variety of things in order to graduate. That's already assessed. Garcia says she's been in talks with Horn in the hopes that he hears her concerns and doesn't go forward with his plan. So this idea that Horn has is something that he campaigned on during his election. Did Horn say what's in the test? Yeah, so I talked to Horn and he says he wants to sort of base it on that previous test that was in the 2000s and pretty much he said it was a standardized test that was sophomore level that combined both math and uh, English and students had multiple chances to pass it. All right.